what's up guys coleslayer92 here and today we're back doing another part of my oh sorry just ate <laughs> of my uh title update 19 survival world this is like part number six or seven i don't know right now i wasn't i wasn't planning on recording at all but something epic happened so let's go ahead and uh and hop back in here and I really wasn't gonna record I was just strip mining and then I found these in a cave look at it look at it five diamonds yes buddy yes so what I think I'm gonna go ahead and do I'm gonna mine them I'm gonna mine how many of them am I gonna mine I'm gonna mine four I'm gonna leave the last one because I want to uh, I want to save that one f if I get a fortune or a silk touch pick because I'm gonna use three for a pickaxe and I already have two and I need two for an enchantment table so let's do this two three four all right now we have four diamonds sick um, and I kinda came down here and to be honest, I don't know uh, my way back. I forgot how to get back to my... Uh... Oh, no, 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 no. This is a terrible scenario. This is a terrible scenario. He could easily... Okay. Okay, yeah. I, uh... What the shit? So... Oh, damn, he almost knocked me in. Um, we're gonna go ahead and go down here. So I was exploring through here. I think is where I came from. Um, I'm not too sure. I think this might be where I came from. Or was it up here? Or is this the way I just... No, I'm pretty sure I came from up here. Pretty sure. Not 100% sure, but I'm pretty sure. Um, yeah, this is where I just came from, because I wanted to mine that iron. Alright, so we're going to explore. While I'm recording, we're going to go ahead and explore... Because I'm not just going to record for like two minutes and then stop recording. That just, that's, that's lame. Alright, and we need iron anyway. We're going to explore these caves a little bit. I've already done a very... <laughs> wow. Uh, I've already gone through them for the most part. I just, uh... I do want to explore a little bit more. See if I can find s some iron. Because I want to make a beacon. Since uh, since the wither is in here, I'm pretty sure you can make beacon. Wait, yeah, you can because I scrolled over it before. You can make beacons. I'm very forgetful with this kind of shit. All right. So because we're able to make beacons, I can make a. I don't know if this is a thing. Y'all are gonna have to let me know. I. Ooh. I could make a beacon in the end. That. Uh, that gives me strength too so let's say I'm fighting the ender dragon and I'm using a uh, I'm I'm able to hit him while he's like near the ground if I have a strength 2 beacon underneath me then I'm gonna be doing a lot of damage to him so that's a thing ah oh, gold sick um, so if you guys could let me know if that works uh, let me know if you can make a beacon in the nether. That'd be awesome because um, I don't want to go to the nether and then uh, and then get wrecked. Don't feel like having that happen. I'm I'm trying to use my beacon and shit and I just get fucked up. That does not sound very appealing to me. This is a lot of coal. I think I'm gonna screenshot this so I can come back at a later date. Um, let me see. There's the coordinates and screenshot. There we go. All right, because this is a whole lot of coal, and if I ever need it, I could just come back here. Because I think I'm fairly good on coal right now. I've what the fuck that opens up? I have like uh, 17 coal blocks. I'm pretty sure somewhere around those figures. Alright, now, getting rid of this water source can be very, very risky. Because if a creeper comes down here, he'll wreck me. 
if there's no water. He'll blow up and take a lot of take a lot of hearts from me. And right now it might be uh, Christmas Day. Actually, <gasps> new. No! Um, it might be Christmas Day. Whenever y'all are seeing this. Um, so, Merry Christmas to you guys. Um, I normally wouldn't celebrate it myself, but my mom, she celebrates Christmas and so does everyone else here. So, why not be festive? And I'm all out of torches, so I'm gonna, I'm probably gonna get my ass kicked in a minute. That leads somewhere I've been already. So, this is over there. See, normally I don't go upwards, and that's an issue. I want to go down here, but I'm... Oh, iron. Yes, I'm glad I came over here. See, if I have enough iron, I think it's a full stack of uh, iron blocks, I'd be able to have a uh, pretty power... <gasps> Ooh, screenshotting the fuck out of these cords. Holy crap. Where's my remote? There it is. Bam, screenshotted. What the fuck, a ravine? A ravine, and I'm all out of torches. And I'm almost at... <gasps> Uh-oh, this is bad. Hey, Tyler! And if y'all don't know... Who... Look at him all swagged out! Look at this fucking guy. Oh, and I uh, finished my mob spawner trap. I finished it. And uh, it works super good. I don't recognize this area. Fuck off. I don't recognize this area. I'm gonna go up here. Maybe I'll see something familiar over yonder. Um. No. No, that's not familiar at all. I'm lost. I'm legitimately lost with no torches. And my pickaxe is about to break. This is not an ideal scenario, to say the least. Um, and you just need to die. You need to die. But yeah, my uh, mob spawner works great. If I can, uh, I see, I see cobble. <gasps> I'm sorry, I panic. Like if if I fall somewhere, I tend to panic because, well, not panic. I I I, I get like. Fuck you. He's gonna kill me. He's gonna kill me. He's gonna kill me. Oh my god. He almost wrecked me. And I'm low on food. Holy shit. This is not ideal at all. Um. Oh. This is part of my mob spawner. This is part of my mob spawner, guys. I'm right above it. So, I'm gonna go ahead and get this iron. Because, look, this is the lift that it goes across. This is the lift. So, I could mine down. I really could. But that's just stupid. That's just stupid because I'll land in the spawner. And I almost walked in lava. Um. What's down here? There's the actual spawner how are you still spawning I lit this up for days oh over there um since it leads over here since it leads over here Pretty sure this is. Oh! I thought this was a spawner. Nah. It's my staircase. Okay. Yeah. I know where I am. <laughs> Alright. Um, today, actually, um, not the day that y'all are watching this. I'm recording this Sunday night. Um, my Texans actually. Uh, they won against the Baltimore Ravens, which was crucial, to say the least. It was very crucial, because they still have a chance to be in the playoffs now. So that's awesome. I'm really happy about that. Um, 
because it, I'd love to see the Texans go into the playoffs. And Case Keenum is back in Houston. I know you guys more than likely aren't Houston Texan fans. Um, most of y'all live up north, I think. And, and um, yeah, Texans won today. So if they win next week, they're in the playoffs. It's as simple as that. If San Diego loses next week and uh, Pittsburgh, if they could win, if they could lose as well, that'd be awesome. But if San Diego and Pittsburgh loses, if one of them two loses, Houston's in the playoffs as long as Houston wins the next game. Because the last game is against the Jacksonville Jaguars, which is a division game. So that could still give them a seed in the wild card, which will be fucking great. Because I think if we get seeded in the wild card and we win our first game, we go up against Indianapolis right after that, which I'm hoping is the case. Because I don't think... Indianapolis has no more division games, I don't think. I think they already played them all. The only other team they could play is the Tennessee Titans, and I don't think that they do. And even if they did play the Titans, I'm sure that that would be a win for the Titans. Uh, I mean, for the for the Colts. So, yeah, I can't really can't really speculate too much on that and I honestly couldn't bring myself to root for the Titans I would want them to tie just leave it as a tie both of them lose not both of them win both of them lose because I hate both those teams with a passion I think I I definitely hate the Titans more though definitely um let's see now let's make some torches I went on a little football rant right there but you know, that's something I really love. I played football in high school, loved it, and, you know, I love watching football, love playing football, love the Houston Texans. Simple as that. I grew up an Oiler fan, but Tennessee stole them away, and so I had no team to root for. So now I, uh, and then in 2001, this is when I started being a Texan fan, when we actually had a fucking team, when Houston had a team. Even though it was uh, David Carr's punk ass, terrible quarterback, even though it was him, it was still a team. So, yeah, that's my take on that. That's why I root for the Texans, because, you know, I, w I was raised that way, as well as being born in Baytown, Texas, which is about 20 minutes outside of Houston. So, okay, I don't know how much of that y'all just got, um, of my little, not rant, but my little declaration of my Houston dedication, my Texans dedication, because my PVR stopped recording, little bitch. Um, so, what we're gonna do, we got 64 torches, got a brand new pickaxe, Oh, I want to put... I'm putting those diamonds up. I'm going to be smart. I'm going to put... No, no, no. I'm going to make a diamond pick so I can uh, get obsidian real quick. So I can start working on my enchanting room. Like, I might do that off screen. I don't like building off screen, but... Sometimes it takes me a long time because I'm indecisive as all hell. Um, when it comes to building. So I think I'm going to build the... Uh, enchantment room off screen just so you guys don't have to suffer with me <laughs> when I'm building so we're gonna go down here get some obsidian uh, I also need books so I'm at the oh the village I forgot about that I can just go to the village raid that house and get books yeah that's smart um, now find some obsidian and I'll show you my uh, mob spawner too. I'll show you it. It's right here. This is the spawner trap. They drop onto here. I think they take uh, 22, uh, 21 or 22 damage. They fall. Bam. I hit them once with a stone sword. They're dead. Um, the reason I have it like this is because I found out baby zombies are a thing. I think y'all saw me encounter my first baby zombie. But... Um, a little baby zombie could fit through a one block high. I, I actually uh, learned that yesterday when I was uh, waiting, when I was seeing if it worked. 
a little baby zombie just comes at me through there. I'm all freaking the fuck out. I'm like, what the fuck? It almost killed me, but obviously it didn't because I still have 33 levels. But still, it was scary as shit. Oh, and this is my mine shaft. This is what I was uh, coming from. See, came out to this, and then I just explored. And we're going to light this up a little bit more because I just don't feel safe. And I already forgot where I found the diamonds. Damn it. Uh, I like remembering where I found them. Uh, I'm going to have to go back on my footage to find where I... Uh, to find where I uh, found those diamonds at. My first diamonds. So I can make a little shrine there. That'd be pretty cool, right? Uh, put my uh, first... Di make a first diamond shrine. That'd be pretty neat, I think. I would I'm gonna do that yeah I'm gonna do it I'm gonna do it and hopefully god they made it to where it takes so long to mine obsidian now and obsidian looks kind of weird on this texture pack I guess um, but you know it's different I really like this texture pack but I might switch it up to the Skyrim texture pack because mmm I don't know if, uh, I'm sure y'all did notice my new intro, um, I just made that like, uh, an hour ago, my new intro that I did, uh, that I've been doing, the, uh, texture pack I was using was a, uh, was the, uh, Skyrim texture pack, only thing I don't like about the Skyrim texture pack is some of the blocks look really funny, like, <gasps> Oh, ah, 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 da, do, no, 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 not doing that. Um, some of the blocks look funny, like, uh, like quartz. Quartz look funny, like, and quartz ores, they look really funny. And I don't like how, uh, I don't like how diamond ores look either. But, uh, I might try it, I might try it. And, um, for my next video, I think I'll give it a shot. I think I'll give it a, I'll give it a college try. Actually, first, see what I did there? That was smart. I would have gotten set on, I would have got set on fire again, and I would have lost the obsidian again. See, that was that was smart plays on my part. See, it's little things that like that that make me like a good survivalist on Minecraft. Like, I might not be an expert builder. But I know damn well I can survive longer than most builders. That's just something I'm really good at. I'm really good at survival. Hell, I'm surviving with 30 levels. I panic a lot, though. I will say that much. I do panic quite a bit. Oh, my phone's dying. Awesome. That's what I'm recording this with. Uh, it's been five minutes, and the last recording was about 13 minutes. So, we're at about 18 minutes. Hmm. Oh, and the reason I'm getting so much is because I also want enough for the nether portal. I'm not going to the nether quite yet, but I'd like to have enough for it. So, I need 14 in total. I need 14 obsidian in total because it's 10 for the nether portal, 4 for the enchantment table, and I also need a... Uh-oh. I also need a buck. I also need one buck so we're gonna go to the uh, village right after this if I can remember where it is and we're gonna go raid there real quick and actually I need a god dang I don't have any food do I I have one loaf of bread I have one loaf of bread hmm I want to at least make the enchantment table before I go. I'm not making the nether portal. God dang it. I fucked up. Right there. And that makes it to where I can get both of these. No prop. But, uh, I am. Ooh, iron. I am getting so lucky with ores. I do need to get... I do need to... Collect a lot of that, though. 
I think I have over a stack now of iron, which is a good start. A very good start. But still, it's not enough. It's nowhere near enough. Let's mine over here. Yeah, that's lava. I don't I don't like that being there. Um Yeah, we're just gonna mine this. But um I think I'm gonna enchant this diamond pick. I'm not too sure yet. Last uh, diamond pick enchantment I got was that Fortune 3 on uh, Minecraftia. That was the last enchantment I did for a diamond pickaxe, and that was just epic. Like, that that was, like, such good timing. That was such good timing. Not timing, um, but... Well, yeah, it was good timing. It was, like, really lucky. It was really lucky. I've never been that lucky with an enchantment on screen. Well, I, I think that was the first time I... Yeah, that was the first time I enchanted something like that. Well, enchanted anything on screen. I remember one time I tried doing a uh, hardcore survival world for uh, YouTube, but then Advanced Warfare came out. <laughs> uh, that's the whole story. That's it. No, no special things happened. Just AW came out, and I, st ooh, and I stopped playing uh, Minecraft for a while. And, you know, I kind of wish I didn't, because Advanced Warfare is not as good as Minecraft. But I was really bored of Minecraft, too. Sort of like how I am with uh, Advanced Warfare right now. Because I already put in a lot of time on it. Well, I haven't put in very much time on it, but I put in enough to where I, didn't want, where I don't want to play it anymore. That's why I'm taking a break, and also I'm taking a break because this controller I'm using cannot be used for Call of Duty. It is so bad. This controller is awful. I This is going to be just a straight up Minecraft controller from now on. Oh wait. That was where I found my first diamonds. Yeah. First diamonds right here. Oh, sick. We found it. I was just talking about this. Cool. I found it. I recognized the uh I recognized the slope when I was running up it. It looked really familiar. And also I recognized this little patch right here. Huh. We were just talking about that like 5 6 minutes ago. Well, probably when the... Yeah, that was like five minutes ago. I don't know. Um, so that means if I go to the right... Parkour across this. I almost had it. I almost had the perfect parkour right there. And then I come up here. And right there are my stairs. Well, it's going to open up right here. Bam! Look at that! That's fucking awesome, guys. I kind of know my way around those caves. Not really. If I see specific landmarks, I know where I'm going. Alright, so... Here's how this is going to go down. Is it day or night? Because if it's daytime, I'll go to to find a village. It, there are monsters nearby. Donde? Where are they? Is the sun rising or setting? I can't tell. Looks like it's rising. Is it? Yeah, it is. Yeah, sun's rising. I don't need to sleep anyway. Sun's rising. So, we're gonna take our two baked taters. Hopefully that's enough to get us through. Damn it, didn't want the bones. Alright. Lock her back up. Where are the monsters? Huh. That was odd. Still no attractive horses over here. Cow. Die. Need your leather. Thank you. I'm still gonna slay out cows when I see them for the most part. 
because their steak will be useful, but also their uh, leather. That one gave me leather. Now, if I'm not mistaking the make mi mistaking mistaken village, oh, village is up here. I'm going the complete wrong way. All right, if I can just remember that, if I just go behind my house and to the left. I'll be able to find the village. This... This is a really cool Extreme Hills biome. I will say that. I really like this seed so far. I know I haven't ventured out much. I haven't really been out outside of my house or my caves very much. But that's because I've been trying to find minerals. Been trying to find ores and shit. And what I think I'm going to do is... Uh, whenever I'm mining, I'll go ahead and... Uh, that looks awesome. That looks so nice. That looks pretty cool too. Whenever I'm mining and I find diamonds, I'll just do what I did today. But <clears throat> next time it'll be with a uh, with a bigger batch, you could say, because I don't want to just mine li not a bigger batch, but like multiple multiple strands, you know. Where there's a lot more diamonds, so it's not like a little five minute video and then I have to improvise for the rest of the time. Which we did good. We found our original diamond spot, and I'm gonna make a little uh, monument there. Put like a sign or something. I, I don't know. But here we are. I didn't even check to see the. Uh... Holy crap, I have. A... <clears throat> I have a terrible aching pain in my nose. It hurts like fuck. Ugh. I haven't been feeling well either lately. I don't know what's up with me. I, I think I might be sick. I hope not. I've been losing my voice a lot lately too. Uh, I just might be sick. Are there any bookshelves in this place at all? Why is there sand in there? Did I just waste my time coming over here? Like seriously, I'll be pissed. I'm, I'm about to be pissed if this was a waste of time. I think this was a waste of time, guys. I think this was a waste of time. Nope, no other houses. And I know these houses don't contain any. All of you guys are farmers, too. That's a terrible trade. That's a fair trade. Not a good trade. A fair trade. Terrible. Decent. Oh, I wonder if you can uh, fish enchanting bugs out. Bad. Terrible. Terrible. All of them have terrible fucking trades. Holy crap. I don't like this village at all. So I'm I'm going to go ahead and end this off right here. And tomorrow we'll uh, we'll work on the uh, enchantment room. So I guess that's going to be it guys. I hope y'all enjoyed. If y'all did, don't forget to smack that like button, comment telling me what you thought and all that good stuff. And um comment telling me what you got for Christmas, I guess if you want to. That's up to you. Um because this is either going up Christmas Eve or Christmas Day, I think, if my math is correct. I'm not too sure. So, yeah, just uh, let me... And also, tell me how I'm progressing. And also, if you'd like to see that Skyrim texture pack, um, I'm probably going to start using it anyway. But that's going to do it, guys. Hope you all enjoyed. Thank you for watching. And this is Coleslaughter92. And I'll see you. Like, comment, subscribe. And share. I almost forgot about those. Huh? I almost forgot about subscribe and sharing. Subscribe if you're new to the channel and share the video on social media and to your friends, etc., etc. This is Cole Slaughter 92. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys later. Peace!